32 weeks. This is the last day of 32 weeks. Baby is doing great. Um, he should weigh almost four pounds now. And he's been kicking up the storm. He's been kicking in my ribs today. Um, he's been really active the last couple days because I haven't been doing a lot. So you may be wondering, I did not get ready today. My hair is not ready. I'm wearing my track shirt. I'm talking quiet because I don't really have a voice. This cold that I've been dealing with for the last little while, finally went into the doctor yesterday and I have walking pneumonia in my right lung. So I'm on antibiotics and hopefully it will be gone by the weekend, which I'm so looking forward to not coughing anymore. Um, so that would be great. But I still wanted to give you guys a 32 week update. So the baby is doing great. The doctor, when I went in, he's like, we're not going to do an x-ray because we just don't need that extra radiation on the baby right now. I can hear the fluid in your lungs. We'll just get you on some medication and get you done with whatever's going on. But he's pretty sure it's walking pneumonia because he can hear the fluid in my lungs. Um, baby is doing good, growing, and I told Curtis the other night that I don't know that there's room for my belly to get any bigger like it feels stretched out so much right now like I don't feel like it's dry and itchy like it was earlier um I would probably get that way because stretch marks will probably happen again here in the next little bit as the baby grows they go from like almost four pounds now to almost eight so that's like twice the size in six weeks five weeks that's crazy five weeks I have a lot to do to get ready guys. Um, I've got a couple videos that I want to make for you guys, but we'll, I've got to get better first. So me, what's going on with me at 32 weeks? The beginning of 32 weeks wasn't horrible. I actually have been feeling pretty good except for this cough and now on the medication it has knocked me out the last couple days. Yesterday especially my blood pressure was like super low, it was only 83 over 53 which for me is the lowest I've ever seen it on myself. I'm usually about 90 over 60, a little bit higher than that while I'm pregnant, but I was standing up and getting kind of woozy yesterday, so I made dinner sitting down. Because, <laughs> um, you know, moms still have to be moms. <coughs> but um, the symptoms of 32 weeks right now have been my hips have been sore um, laying down at bed I don't want to move because I don't want to have to disrupt my lungs when I'm breathing well but last night my hips were so sore I had to switch to the other side and um, they were just crazy sore all night um, what else the coughing still makes me pee my pants so the relaxin is working with my hips and everything else um, I have been dizzy but I think that's from the sickness and there was something else that was important besides the memory loss that I have right now all the time um, something, 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 something well hopefully I'll remember it in a little bit um, <coughs> I haven't gained any weight in the last month, we'll see what the doctor says about that, but I think it's because it's finally cooled down here. It's been like in the 90s for forever, and this last week it dropped down to low 80s in the 70s. By the weekend we're supposed to be in the 50s, and they're talking about snow in the mountains, which is crazy because we literally have been from 90 down to this like in a week, but that's how it goes here. Um, but I think it's made my fluid retention kind of go away. My feet don't get super swollen anymore. I can wear shoes, which is great. Um, let's see. I'm going to go to the bathroom a lot. Baby is pressing on my bladder all the time, and as he gets bigger, my bladder gets... It doesn't get smaller, but it doesn't have much room to get anything in it. Um, I've been drinking lots of fluids. Um, what else? This is bugging me. There was really something that was a 
the symptom I thought I could share with you guys. Aha! While editing, I remembered what the symptom was. I have been having hot flashes. Now, this could be due to the medication and the sickness, but I don't think it is because I've been having them before. I'll be fine, and then all of a sudden I will be like, oh my gosh, I'm dying. I need to go take a cold shower yesterday. In fact, I did, after I was cooking dinner, I had to go take a cold shower and just let my body cool down a little bit. So those have been super nice. <laughs> not really, but I get like these hot flashes and I'm not a person that is usually hot. Like we went to Florida in like 85 degree weather with 110% humidity and I'm fine. But now I'm at like 70 degree weather, 70, 70 degree weather with the air conditioning on me and still dying. So um, that was the other symptom that I wanted to make sure that you guys knew. So, <laughs> so back to the vlog. Tell me in the comments if you know what this reference is. I have gotten acne again, but and dandruff. That's great, but I think that's more due to the change of the weather. Every time the weather changes, that happens to me anyway. And then having the baby and the hormones doesn't help with that. We, I will be doing the giveaway video. The plan was to do that today, but I have been knocked out, you guys. So that's why I'm not even dressed. We're not ready for it. Um, so hopefully tomorrow I'm feeling better and we can get that up by no later than Friday. And let you guys know who won for that and then do our big... Um, get to know us video. I'm super excited for that. I want to feel good for that because I want to share that with you guys. I'm hoping that you guys are liking these updates. The views say that you do, but um, I know that I really like while I've been pregnant to go and see other vloggers and see how they're doing at my stage. And so it's been fun for me to be able to do this and hopefully help some of you that are at that point. Um, or coming up to that point that you have something to look forward to or you know that you're not alone if you're not feeling well or whatever um, Yeah, so I think that is it. Thanks you guys so much for your support Love ya. We'll see you down Anderson Lane later. Bye